Hi guys, I'm back. I'm here at TUC uh, Congress House in central London. Just going around about seeing some of the, the, the people who are out there putting their stands out. And one of the people we've got is War on Want. And War on Want is doing a lot of interesting things that are promoting much of the uh, sort of... How can I put this? Real life issues that are going on at the moment, whether it's cost of living crisis, whether it's taxation, climate change, they're taking a holistic point of view and trying to find good solutions working with trade union movements across not only the northern hemisphere but also the southern hemisphere to find great solutions that will benefit all. I'm with uh, Jackie, who's, who's here today, and Jackie's kindly uh, given me permission to have a chat with her. <laughs> Jackie, feel free. Hi. Tell us a little bit about War on One. Well, War on One uh, is a, it's an anti-poverty charity. We work with uh, unions, with workers' associations, both here and across the global south, and some of the most inspiring community groups that you could imagine. Um, and we we cover a lot of issues. We work here at, with trade unions, and unions affiliate to us. Our store, for example, does, <coughs> and. Uh, what we look at is, amongst other things, supply chain issues, which is what most people can understand about um, sort of development issues, if you like, is that when you go into a shop to buy something and it costs one ninety nine, you now know that there's a human price for that. And one of the things that we're trying to do is to bring the local and the global together. So people who work in the retail industry, for example, not a well-paid part of the economy and people who are producing the clothes for example our partners in Sri Lanka who are at the moment being harassed for being trade union members we're trying to bring those two together and where we've got the company in the middle where all that money sits um, and all those profits sit we want to be able to use that leverage to be able to make a real change to uh, workers' lives at both ends of the supply chain. But we also work on the broader global economy issues, as we say, of tax avoidance, how much is, how much is removed from um, exchequers across the world, money that could be used to invest in the public sector, in industries like health, education, welfare, but instead is disproportionately found in the pockets of the of the already wealthy and uh, we have two new reports one on food security um, and one on the fashion industry not just about the supply chain but also about the impact on climate and our view when it comes to global justice and climate justice is that any any conversation about a just transition is that that is something that has to be done with working people and not done to them and that's why we're working with the union movement here and again with our partners in the global south to come to hopefully to be able to find a solution that it enables a better future for everybody but that does not just create a situation that makes things much better in the global north but again at the expense of the global south because that's all been done before, tried colonialism, tried imperialism, not great. Let's not do that again. So this is a question I've got to ask because this, based on what you're doing right now, it is a global uh, effort, not just in the UK but outside of the UK as well. We're outside of the EU, so we're having a lot of the legislations having to be revoked because of Brexit. How are you dealing with other countries when it comes to their legislation and border issues because obviously you, 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 you're dealing with the south in terms of the global south so they're going to have their legislation and their st uh, standards that they've set you're also dealing with our standards within the UK and probably in, in Europe as well how, how do you navigate that sort of minefield of legislation but that's why we work with partners that's 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 precisely why we work with partners as as a, a, a charity one of the limitations is that we are not supposed to um, alter other governments legislation but we actually by working with partners we we are not an aid agency so we do not say we have the answers we work with partners who know very much uh, what the, what the solutions that they're trying to reach are what we offer is the um, is a solidarity um, B to be able to bring to the attention of a broader audience what some of the global economic issues really are.
I mean, it's absolutely fascinating. I hope you, as the, the, the viewers, have found this fascinating too. How can a person get involved? Well, if you're a member of the trade union, you can affiliate your branch to us. We're very good value, £25 a year. Um, and if you go on to the War on One website, which is waronone.org, or indeed contact me at War on One, which is jsimpkins at waronone.org, I can make sure that that happens. You can join as an individual member. Uh, clearly, you can make donations, but we have the majority of the major trade unions in the UK are affiliates, but you can uh, the unions can affiliate at national, region, regional and branch level. And we try to get out as much as we can to speak to um, branches. We can obviously now do that online, but we're willing to travel around and, and give a talk on any of the issues that uh, we cover. So that's a good way. And also, once you're, once you're with us, you'll know when we're going to be doing events, for example, the Rana Plaza walking tour that we did the other night, which was a commemoration of the factory collapse in Bangladesh 11 years ago now, but um, highlighting some of the companies that have maybe sort of stepped back a little bit from the commitments that they made at the time of that, that terrible accident. So, so yes, there's, there's something for you to do. Um, and as I say, if you're part of a trade union, then you're part of a family that is, is a global movement. Um, there is very much lots for you to do. So uh, please join us. Where are you based? Are you based in London? We're based in London. Yeah, okay, we're so based in London. guys, I know there's a lot of uh, branches who are within the London area. You'll be seeing this. Please feel free to book her to your branch meetings. Get involved, you know. Why not? It's something different to add to your branch than the usual bits and pieces, you know, do something different. And your members will appreciate it even more. Give more value to your members. And guys, I'll, I'll uh, leave this to you guys. I'll put some more details on here and then you can get in contact with, with uh, Jackie. Jackie. Yeah, I keep saying, I was going to say June. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm feeling the sunlight here. So I'll get, let Jackie get in contact. You guys get in contact with Jackie and be happy with it. Brilliant. I'll catch up with you later. Take care.